Type A 101 outrigger trusses. So you can see what we've done to the model now is added trusses and columns. What this does is it helps to engage the whole building in resisting the lateral loads. The first thing I'll do is just apply a force to the building without holding down the base of the outrigger truss. What you can see here is that the outside column comes up off the base. It shows yet again that there's going to be tension on one side of the building. Compression, of course, happening on the opposite. If we hold down the building, it takes much more force to push the building the same amount of distance. What this system does is it helps to prevent the overturning of the building. Previously I had mentioned that I had this extra base attached to the core of the building. In reality, Taipei 101 doesn't have this block at the base. We just have the outrigger columns on either side supporting it in that way. Another thing that you'll notice when I push on the building without locking the column down is that the core tends to deflect in a typical cantilevered shape. We call a cantilever something that's supported just at one end, like this element here. In this case, gravity is acting along the length, pulling it in this very predictable shape. If we stand the cantilever up on end, like this, we basically have a tall building. And if we push on it at the one end, it's the same shape that starts to form. That's the shape that the core of the building would take by itself. However, by adding the outrigger columns to the outside of the building, it changes the way that the core deforms. In each one of these trusses, it actually serves to righten the building, to straighten the core. So now, if I hold down and push onto it, you see that the, core's de the core deforms in almost like an S-shaped pattern. Of course, the force that I'm using to hold down the column is represented by the hundred stories worth of weight that we try and put on these outside columns to hold them from coming up off the ground. So the end effect is a building that takes much more force to deflect the same amount, and also a building that takes less time to go from one extreme all the way to the other extreme. This helps to make the building much more comfortable for the occupants.